Hi friends, this is Leela. Welcome to my channel Leela Webdev. In this video, we will try to see about the relationship with the MongoDB. Know about the relationship like one to one. Any? So we will try to see one by one the all the relation. First, we will try to see about the one to one relation. So now, what is this one to one relation? One to one relationship. You have a data, and it should be the data and uh, have another data. For this data, so this is the only one it will be existing. No, anybody, any other one will be sharing that record. Then it is called as a one to one. I will try to show you with a simple example. Let's say, let's say that I have a person, and this person name, name and we have a details of person name, age and country let's say or city we have the details and we want to know the passport passport details of this let's say that we have an another document passport details and in this passport details we know we will be having all the passport details like passport now so now let's say that for a leela okay a person with the name leela he has only one passport, one passport number. That means he cannot have the multiple passports. So he can have only the one passport number. And here in the passport, okay, in the passport detail, each passport number will be associated to only one person. Okay, so for one passport, one one passport number, you cannot have multiple persons. One passport number will be assigned to only one person only. And here for one person you will be having only one passport number here there is no one to one relationship and also for the passport details you have one also one to one relation person and a passport number these are one to one relationship person can only have one passport but otherwise a passport can only have one person passport can a passport number cannot have multiple persons one uh, one passport number cannot be assigned to the multiple persons and also a single person cannot have the multiple passport number now this is thing so these are two, two things are related to each other so how so like this in this type of scenarios how we can save the data normally if you are having one to one relationship so we can have a person details table okay you can have a person document for a collection and in this person co collection itself so you can save the passport details for that person itself if you want you can have an another table okay another collection for the passport details and you can save this id okay, the save passport id the reference id in the person details directly okay so like this also we can do it so that means you can have a two collections like person collection and passport collection. you can create a passport detail, okay and for, and that reference id you can mention it to the person this is uh, what i can say is so this one i will show you the disadvantages of this one or otherwise you know that the person has only one single passport you can also have an embedded document that you can embed the passport details into the person document i will try to show you this scenario so depending on the requirement you can select these all things so according to your requirement choice whether you are developing an app or a website whatever the thing you develop. so depending on your requirements whether you want to make a collection or otherwise you can embed the document to that same which depends on your logic and all those things and i will tell you the disadvantages of this one so by maintaining the two table, two collections what will what will the thing happen now if you go here into this mongodb and here first i will create a person first i will create a separate table separate uh, separate collections then i will try to show you for example let's say that i am having a passport i will create and i will create one passport set one here i will create try to create country And the passport here I'll be I have created. So if I try to see deep dot dot passport dot find one if I dot find one if I am able to find the document that is nothing but passport number. This one single document. Now what I will try to do is I will try to create a person. 
if I am having a person in persons dot insert sorry. now let's say that guy name is and age is that. here uh, I can and I have a passport so but the passport is nothing but the passport number is this one instead of mentioning this passport number duplication here I can take this reference ID and I can add it here try to say that passport ID I can write it here I can directly paste this I have pasted let's try to see that it now it is in if I try to see db dot person dot find person dot find one now here I am able to get the details of a person name Leela, age and country and also the passport details that is nothing but a reference we are having with another collection so passport id and this passport id this uh, this we are having and using this reference we can get that passport collection and we can get the passport details now i want to get the passport details of a of the person leela so let's say how we can get try to get it out first what i can do db dot person dot find one so i am trying to get the details whose name is leela now if i try to get so i am not getting the passport details i am getting just the reference of this if i want to get the passport id i can do the passport id i am getting the passport id now how can i get the, my passport number how can we get a passport number oh i need to capture this id and i need to go to the passports collection so i need to get it. how can i get so here let's say that passport equal to dot person dot find one of i am doing this dot passport id i am trying to save it in one variable okay, i got the passport id now i will go to the passport passport dot find one dot find one which is having an id of passport i stored it right so i can have passports now if i try to press enter so now here i am able to get the details of the passport now here for doing this one all oh i for doing this one also what i am trying to do i am querying two times that means first i need to get the passport id from the person's table person's collection and using that passport id and again i need to query the passports collection to get the passport number of that particular person with name that means we are running the two kit as this mongodb and we are having less number of documents in the collection so we can find it very but think once we are having hundreds of hundreds of documents in the collection so doing two types of query will be have a performance know that the person has only one passport and the passport number is associated with one person why can't we embed that passport details into the person itself so here let's see that that person try to show you that the scenario any now here i can do in a such a way that instead of having a separate passport then that person's card that here i can use and here and and i, I can have a passport catch the passport and also the passport but whatever now i am embedding this passport it now if i try to see the dot person dot find one try to see here the name leela the person is the name leela, and he has also the person passport details so now if i want to get the details of this guy if i want to get the person just passport details i can do something like that and i can go to the passport details and i can get the passport number for that now you will be able to see 
now you are able to get the passport number with very easily by using one query itself so depending on the situation whether you want to get a separate collection uh, uh, or you want to you can embed the collection so depending on the scenarios you want to do so for example let's say that I want to update this passport it now i can directly go to the person and i can directly update it so not a problem so this all depends so depends on this most probably one to one relationships are having try to maintain in one collection because the both are related to one to one only so one person can have only one passport and that passport is associated to one person so update also will be very easily so all the things will become very easy These are all the passport uh, how we will be one to one hope you understood about this one relation and if you want you can also maintain the reference passport details and you can not a problem that is up to you depends so you can do it hope you understood about this if have any doubts or any sessions please post the comments below to this video and if you like this video please do support me by subscribing to my channel thank you